So the Shiba Eternity game launched, you know, a few days ago, and I would say that it's been wildly successful. Okay, and I I played it a bunch. I enjoy playing it. You know, I it, I've done well for the most part. I've done not so well some other parts, and I want to talk about the the big picture. Okay, and why this is important. You know, <clears throat> the game has done very, very well for what it is. I know that it hit the top 20 in the the, uh, the app store for app for iOS devices. And, you know, there's there have been a large, large number of people that have been downloading it. And maybe the game's not for you. And that's completely fine, right? Maybe you're not a gamer. Maybe you don't like these types of games in general. And that's okay. But what you have to look at is the, the big picture in these sort of things, okay? The big picture for launching this game is adoption okay it also has to do with the burn and you know every time i make a video you know you may be looking for some kind of indicator that you know the price is just going to skyrocket and jump a big percentage and stuff that's not quite how it works okay we, we obviously need long-term adoption and you know this Shiba eternity game is a way to bring in long-term adoption i mean gaming is a, an untapped multi-billion dollar market we're starting to see more and more gaming projects come into the crypto space okay more more and more games are starting to be built on blockchain and this is something that i think a lot of people don't necessarily realize you know you may again look at it and say oh yeah the game this is this is stupid or the game sucks or blah 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 right just you know think about it this way again it's it's another way for people to get eyes on shiba and you okay Ask yourself how many other top coins are doing this right now, because Cardano's not doing this, Ethereum's not doing this. Okay, Bitcoin definitely isn't doing this. Bitcoin hasn't done anything in a long time. Okay, so the big picture is that this is good for long-term Shiba Inu. I don't want necessarily well, you know, price performance. Okay, obviously it's good for long-term price performance, but it's good for adoption. It brings more people into the ecosystem that weren't necessarily here here before. I think that there are some people that get a little short-sighted and don't necessarily see the long-term benefits of something like this happening. And it's going to be the same story too once we have other things come out. You know, once we have uh, the SHIB metaverse come out, you know, maybe the metaverse isn't for you. I've never spent a day inside a metaverse. I have no idea what I would <laughs> what I would even begin to do in there. So maybe it's not for me. And again, maybe that's not for you too, but Again, you have to look at the big picture at these sort of things, okay? Because they do nothing but help benefit you as a holder of Shiba Inu. So that's all I really got for you in this video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, if you haven't already, <laughs> make sure you go ahead and hit that subscribe button, hit the little bell. It'll keep you updated anytime there's new content live here on my channel. Make sure you show your support. It's been going well so far, and we look to keep this thing going. So I hope you guys have a wonderful day. And I hope to catch you in the next video. Take care, guys.